We now know that Galactus could have been in Thor Love and Thunder. Welcome to the Chaos Multiverse, everybody. Deleted scenes or concept art, not scenes, concept art that could have translated into scenes has now surfaced. This is uh, from thedirect.com, and uh, I have a strong opinion about this, and I'll explain what I mean uh, when we get to it. So, welcome to the channel, everybody. Make sure you drop a like. Make sure you're subscribed. We are ramping up the DC and Marvel coverage on this channel, and pop culture in general. If it's interesting, we're going to talk about it. So I encourage you guys to stick around every single day because there will probably be multiple uploads as we try to cover everything out there for you guys on the daily. Now, Thor Love and Thunder. I mean, you either liked it or you hated it. There really wasn't a middle ground for a lot of people in the Marvel community or just in the comic community. I mean, it was really a uh, one or the other. Me personally... I thought it was a fun watch. Definitely uh, kind of went the wrong way of what I want Thor to be. But, I mean, they gave me Thor from Infinity War and Endgame. Serious type Thor that had battles and everything going on internally. And then we literally turned it into the Comedy Shack. But, I mean, I enjoyed it. It was a good watch. It wasn't a top 10 MCU movie for me. But it was a good watch. Now, the question is... What happens moving forward, right? Well, that's a question for another day because uh, Chris has said that Thor is going to have to completely change if he's going to keep going, which I 100% agree. But that's not what this video is about. It's about Galactus and a scene that could have happened in Thor 4. Concept art has been uh, put out. Concept art for Thor Love and Thunder by Anthony Wynn was revealed and there was an unused scene featuring Galactus. If you don't know who Galactus is, he's the devourer of worlds. And he's basically one of the biggest bads ever. He goes to these worlds, he eats these worlds to get the to get the celestial eggs out of them because he is there for balance. He's not necessarily a bad guy. He's trying to keep the celestials from unbalancing everything in the cosmos. So he goes to these, these planets that have the eggs. His herald tells him which planet to go to. That's usually Silver Surfer. And he goes and devours them and devours the eggs to keep that balance. Well, we haven't seen him in the MCU, and I'm telling you right now, when we see him, uh, it has to be a big deal. But there was concept art of Mighty Thor, Jane Foster, actually battling Galactus in space. It wasn't just one image. It was two images of her going up against him, which is pretty crazy because that means they were thinking about putting Galactus in Thor Love and Thunder, and I'm here to tell you, they dodged a bullet. That would have been a massive mistake with the tone and the theme of that movie. You would have wasted one of the biggest super villains in comic book history. I personally think Galactus, if they're not going to bring him in in phase five or six for the multiversal saga, then keep him on the shelf. Keep him away and put him in in phase seven. Let him be the next big bad. You have to figure out a big bad. Thanos, I mean, left big, big shoes to fill. Kang the Conqueror looks like he's going to be able to do that and probably another one or two supervillains. But you have to think after that. What do you do for Phase 7, 8, and 9? You go with the Devourer of Worlds. You continue on that celestial path and uh, what's going on with all of those. And that's your big bad. You do not waste Galactus in... Thor Love and Thunder. That would have been horrible. People would have been so pissed off. So, I'm glad it didn't happen. It's cool to see there was concept and actual, I guess, conversation about bringing him in to fight mighty Thor Jane Foster. But in the end, it didn't happen. And uh, I, for one, uh, think that was absolutely the right decision. I just, I do. Mighty Thor can't fight Galactus. I mean, Galactus, I mean, that would be one of those where it's your your entire Avenger team ups and everybody else, every other group that's out there, whoever it is, that would have to be that level. Let me know what you guys think. I'll see you soon.